A group of concerned citizens started the campaign, Māori Self-Determination for Health. We call for the government to adopt Māori commissioning by the Māori Health Authority. This is a transformational and innovative way to achieve fair health for all of us. This is outlined in the alternate view, the recommendation of the majority expert panellists of the Health and Disability System Review. Kia ora, ko Granberg and toko ingoa. Uh, ko ahau he mokapona o patoa nei. Te tahi o ngā rangatira tawhito o ngā puhi nui tonu. I'm the Chief Executive Officer of the Public Health Association of New Zealand and the PHA joins this campaign and supports the call to action for Māori self-determination and health. And so the Public Health Association of New Zealand is calling on Calvin Davis, Pini Henare, Kiri Tapu Allen, Willie Jackson, Mecca Faitiri, Nanaya Mahuta, Porto Williams, Marama Davidson. We're calling on you to support this call for an independent Māori health authority. We're not calling for a separatist agency. Partnership is not about separatism. It's about recognising the rights of different groups to exercise their individuality within the context of one nation. The health system for Māori is broken, and it's been broken for a long, long time. So one of the challenges of our system is democracy itself, which favours the majority and penalises minority groups such as Māori, Pacifica peoples, and other minority peoples who live in this country. And the end result is that we have the significant levels of poverty that we have in this country. We have inequalities. We have disparities that have plagued our country, frankly, for decades. And when you add to that systemic bias, otherwise known as institutional racism, that colors the policies, the practices, the structures throughout our country, then it is that you get a better understanding of our current situation. We have a system of advantage based on the majority or default race. Here in Aotearoa, New Zealand, the default race is considered to be people of Pākehā or European descent. Structural and institutional racism are when policies and practices are upheld that benefit the majority race. This leads to interpersonal racism, when remarks or acts between persons of different races highlight you are not the default, and to internalised racism when you hate the colour of your own skin. In 2021, racism was declared an epidemic in Aotearoa. No one is immune to this virus. This virus does not discriminate. Gross underrepresentation of Māori and Pacifica in our health workforce. In 2020, Māori made up 16% of the population, yet less than 4% of doctors were Māori. In contrast, in positions such as cleaners and orderlies, Māori and Pacifica representation match the population. We can't go back in time to reverse the ongoing and compounding effects of the heavy burden of colonisation on our health system. Māori must determine their own health or haora with tino ranga tiratanga. Health isn't just about being physically well. It's affected by a bunch of wider factors. Things like housing, education and justice, the social determinants of health that are the levers for change. We are powerless to effect change if we begin by saying it can't be done. 
You can do something today. Read this petition. Sign it. This, this country is grounded in te tiriti or waitangi. Te tiriti or waitangi speaks to us of the partnership relationship between Māori and the Crown. That relationship is a relationship of equals. It's not a relationship of a majority versus a minority. So this campaign that I'm speaking in support of is for Māori self-determination in health. I note that the same theme is emerging right now with Oranga Tamariki. So this is about structural change. And the Public Health Association of New Zealand supports the call for the establishment of an independent Māori health authority with fully empowered commissioning rights where Māori can make decisions over issues that affect Māori. Now this is an opportunity to lead the world, to lead the world with an Indigenous health authority model that is innovative, anti-racist and embedded in the very communities that it serves. Kia ora tātou.